Supplementing this essential mineral daily can lower blood pressure, fight inflammation, and detox excess uric acid from your kidneys. Catherine from WK here. Welcome to our journey together to a better kidney health. High uric acid levels are not just the cause of a very painful condition, gout. They also cause uncontrolled inflammation, which can damage the kidneys. There are five natural ways to lower uric acid levels fast and effectively that will also help you fighting inflammation and improve kidney health. Number five, magnesium. Magnesium is a mineral that's crucial to the body's function. It helps keep blood pressure normal, bone strong, and the heart rhythm steady. Unfortunately, Magnesium deficiency is very common among people with kidney problems and it's associated with high blood pressure, inflammation, and high uric acid levels. So if you are having muscle cramps frequently, magnesium deficiency could be a cause. Luckily, you can easily supplement this essential mineral and get a ton of benefits. In particular, a 2015 study published on the journal PLUS ONE link increased magnesium intake to lower uric acid levels. So, taking magnesium as a supplement may be able to reduce frequency and intensity of gout symptoms. Researchers think that it may be due to magnesium ability of fighting chronic inflammation in the body. Additionally, magnesium deficiency is strongly linked with high blood pressure. Correcting this deficiency can lower blood pressure quickly. You can get magnesium from foods such as greens, leafy vegetables like spinach, but also nuts, especially almonds. However, many foods rich in magnesium are also rich in potassium and people with kidney problems are often recommended to avoid them. Magnesium supplements are very cheap. We're talking about $6 for a 6-month supply and easy to find. I bought this one at the supermarket. What you should know about magnesium is that not all doctors recommend supplementing it to people with kidney disease. This is because, just like potassium, the kidneys don't filter it well when they're impaired. However, unlike for potassium, studies have linked higher serum magnesium levels to less mortality in people with chronic kidney disease stage 4 and 5. A different study found out that supplementing 360 mg of magnesium once or twice daily for up to 8 months was safe for CKD patients in stage 3 and 4 and associated with better heart health. Still, be safe and consult your doctor and maybe get tested for serum magnesium levels before using this cheap but powerful supplement to protect the kidneys from uric acid. And guys, let me know if you want to know more about magnesium and kidney health. If you're interested, I can make a whole video about it to show you what kidney-friendly foods contain it and what supplements and dosages are best. Let me know in comment section. Now, one of the fastest ways to prevent gout attacks is... Number 4. Avoid trigger foods. You should know that 1 out of 10 people with chronic kidney disease have gout. A painful condition caused by uric acid and triggered by purine-rich foods and sugar-rich foods. So, avoid them! Foods rich in purine include meat, especially organ meat, but also bacon, turkey, goose, veal, venison. Now guys, avoiding meat is also a great way of improving the health of your kidneys. So always avoid these foods here. Certain seafoods such as shellfish, anchovies, sardines, herring, mussels, and other types of fish rich in mercury should be avoided too because they contain large amounts of purines. Now, alcohol is probably the worst offender here. Excessive alcohol consumption is very dangerous and beer is specifically cited by literature as a beverage to avoid. The reason is that beer is known to increase people's uric acid levels and to reduce the kidney's ability to clear the substance from the body. Very important thing to avoid. Sugary foods and beverages. They are known to raise uric acid levels and to worsen gout symptoms. Now, I really hate sugar. Food companies secretly 
put it in everything because it's addictive and they don't really care if it destroys our health they just care about selling us more junk food sugar but also fruit juices foods containing agave nectar high fructose corn syrup even most honey is sold by grocery stores all these foods are proven to be inflammatory they raise your blood pressure more than salt make kidney disease progress faster and they raise uric acid levels avoid anything containing sugar refined carbs like white breads cakes and cookies should be avoided too they also raise uric acid levels now here's a very tasty fruit that is going to detox your body from uric acid instead number three cherries yes as incredible as it may seem this tasty fruit actually decreased uric acid levels and gout risk a 2012 study of 633 people with gout found that eating cherries for two days lowered the risk of a gout attack by a whooping 35% compared with eating no cherries, which is great, frankly. And among people who also use allopurinol, an anti-gout drug, the combination of the drug and cherries lowered the risk of another attack by 75%, way better than the drug alone. Now, the fact that cherries have been shown to lower the levels of uric acid in the body means that they will also protect the kidneys. Researchers think that this benefit is due to the high polyphenols content of cherries, a powerful plant chemical that help fight cellular damage, reduce inflammation and promote overall health by reducing oxidative stress. Cherries are also packed with vitamin C, also known to decrease uric acid levels and boost immune function not to mention that cherries are very kidney friendly, less than 200 milligrams of potassium per cup, and they are in season right now. So eat cherries or try unsweetened cherry juice. And I also have an even more powerful natural anti-inflammatory that I want to show you. Number two, try a turmeric latte. As we have seen, gout is an inflammatory condition. This means that turmeric, one of the most powerful natural anti-inflammatories in the world, can help. The curcumin in turmeric has a wide array of benefits for your kidneys, including the ability to lower uric acid levels. And it's also useful to lower pain related not just to gout attack, but almost to anything inflammatory. Another very powerful natural remedy that can help decreasing uric acid levels is ginger. Ginger is often used both taken by mouth or topically to treat gout. And many people don't know this, but coffee can help too. Actually, coffee is thought to reduce uric acid levels through several mechanisms and research links increase coffee consumption to less gout risk. Amazing! Now guys, in one of my recent videos, I've presented a very healthy coffee recipe you can try. It's great to lower uric acid levels. Here's how to make it. We need 1 4 teaspoon ground cinnamon, 1 teaspoon ground turmeric. This is basically the most powerful natural anti-inflammatory on earth. We need 1 4 teaspoon ground ginger, very rich in antioxidants. 1 tablespoon coconut oil A healthy fat source, great to slow down the absorption of caffeine and avoid so many problems caused by coffee And 1 pinch of ground black pepper Black pepper is very useful, it will make the curcumin in turmeric available to the body Okay, let's combine these ingredients in a cup Adding hot water very slowly In the meantime, I've brewed a cup of coffee. And let's add some almond milk. Number one, drink more water. Keep your body weight under control and exercise. Okay guys. These three things together are the solution to a really large number of health problems. 
Drinking more water, eight glasses per day or more, is going to prevent uremic acid buildups since uric acid leaves the body via your urine. Keep the right body weight is crucial. It relieves the joints from a lot of tension and really helps with kidney health. Exercising is not always possible when gout and kidney disease are present, but if you can exercise, do it! It's the fastest and most effective way of detoxifying the body. Low impact body weight exercises like those of my workouts for healthy kidney are one of the best options. Researchers have found that fat in the body carries more uric acid than muscle. Thus, when you reduce body fat, you can reduce uric acid levels in your blood. Bottom line, kidney problems are often correlated to gout, a painful condition, and high uric acid levels may represent a serious and underestimated treat for kidney health. The natural ways to keep them under control I've shown you today may really help, but if your levels are too high, you will need the help of your doctor. Unfortunately, a lot of doctors still aren't testing kidney patients for uric acid levels. So make sure you have your uric acid levels tested during your next routine checkup because that's very useful to prevent gout attacks. And remember that NSAIDs, non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, which are the first line medications for gout pain, are not safe for people with kidney problems. But allopurinol is, so be 100% sure that your doctor knows about the health of your kidneys when prescribing you a gout treatment. As usual, a new video is coming next Friday and I really hope to see you there. In the meantime, keep taking good care of your kidneys and be good to yourself. This is all for today. Thank you for watching.